overcome something like this and emotional loss? Yeah, I mean, uh, in OT, uh, it's going to it's going to go one way or the other. Uh, we've been uh, very good so far and uh, we, we had our, our looks also and uh, we didn't get the bounce today. Uh, but I think the vibe is, uh, is pretty good. Uh, I think uh, we found our, our game and uh, certain moment uh, we didn't play our best, but we were able to fight through adversity and Varley was there for us uh, the whole game to, to make all the big save, uh, to give us a chance to, to, to come back in this game and have a chance to win it. Andrew Gross, Newsday. Yeah, Varley, you were tracking the puck so well. What were, you know, the second and third period as, as the, the shot totals were, were going on and, and, you know, you were down by one. It, what was the thought that you just couldn't give up another one there? You had to keep it within one to give your team a chance? Um, yeah, it wasn't a lot of uh, shots in the first period. And then um, the second, uh, the first half and the second. Uh, so I had to... Um, find a focus and then uh, stay in the game. Um, you know, it's not easy game uh, uh, to play when you have when you don't have a lot of shots in the net. Um, but I was able to stay uh, focused and then uh, and then, um, you know, I think Boston came out uh, like really strong in the third period and then they had a lot of shots uh, in the third. Um, I was able to uh, make a couple uh, uh, key saves, I think. And then, uh, you know, we scored at the end. Uh, so that was uh, Huge uh, goal by Barzi. Um, and then overall, it was a close game. Ollie Both Walker teams. near post. Semyon, what did you see on that first goal? And, and how would you evaluate how you've personally performed in the opening minutes of each of your start? Uh, I mean, uh, um, the first goal was, uh, I, I thought that was a good shot by Smith. Uh, you know, um, they, uh, they make a... Uh, a good play, uh, making a good pass from the corner um, in the middle uh, of the ice, and then uh, he found the net. Um, so um, we gotta give him credit. That was a great shot. And then, um, like uh, as for me, uh, I just tried to uh, prepare myself for uh, to play a good game. Uh, I, I knew it's not gonna be easy one, and then um, I think I was able to um, to deal with uh, the pressure uh, pretty good today, and then. Uh, Came out pretty strong. Tom Galitti, NHL.com. Semyon, what, what did you see on the on the winning goal? Did he just he just kept surprise you with the shot? How did how did you see that one? Uh, I gotta watch replay. You know, the game just uh, we just finished the game. Um, I didn't even see the replay. Um, so you know, I I gotta kind of go back in the locker room and then um, I I don't really have an answer for you right now. Um, it's kind of a weird shot, but uh, the puck found the net. Um, so that was a good play, I guess, uh, by Marshawn. Bruce Beck, NBC. Hey, G, is it frustrating? Is it deflating to lose a game like this when it felt like you had the momentum and were really dominating overtime? Well, you you always want to win the game, and it's way more uh, way more fun, and that's the goal uh, of the playoffs to win uh, every night. Uh, but it's not like this. Boston's a good team also. Uh, they're they're going to play uh, an art game. They, they, they play well, and... Uh, on our side, I mean, uh, we just got to bounce back and I'm not too worried uh, with the character there is in this room and uh, goalies we have, they give us a chance every night to uh, to win a hockey game. So uh, I'm very positive and I'm I'm very excited for, for the next game uh, at home. I think uh, we're going to bounce back and uh, I know the guys are, are hungry for a win. Last one in English here, Andrew Gross, Newsday. Barley, I, I was just curious, um, you know, Ilya starts the, the last four games of the Penguin series, the first game uh, of this series, you know, through practice, is it difficult to, to stay sharp when, when you're not getting the game action? And it, were, were you curious or questioning whether, whether you would get another opportunity the way Ilya was playing? Yeah, you know, Ilya was playing outstanding. Um... Well, you know, uh, and then um, I was it, it was exciting for a team, you know, to see uh, the guy come in and then uh, uh, play um, uh, strong uh, behind us, you know. So, I mean, um, I was rooting for him uh, while I was sitting in the bench. And then I was just, uh, um, you know, if I had a, if I had a chance to practice, uh, I would go on the ice to practice. You know, I, I mean, doing that uh, 
time I had a lot of uh, goalie practices and then I was just trying to stay in shape and then uh, and uh, you know the playoff is a uh, is a long run so you never know um, what's going to happen so you always have to um, be ready um, and then that's what I was uh, trying to do. Last one here Martin Leclerc. Thanks, uh, Jean-Gabriel. J'aimerais savoir c'est quoi le feeling un peu de l'équipe après cette uh, défaite crève cœur en prolongation et aussi comment vous allez aborder le prochain match. Oui, euh, ben on va, on va essayer de, de gagner le prochain match. Euh, évidemment, c'est à la maison. Euh, c'est jamais le fun de euh, perdre un, un match euh, en, en sortant. Euh, on a réussi à le faire à Boston. Euh, quand c'est en prolongation, c'est euh, une question de, de, de un lancé, ça peut aller d'un côté ou de l'autre. Euh, on a eu nos chances aussi. Euh, malheureusement, ça n'a pas rentré. Euh, mais on va être prête pour euh, rebondir euh, samedi.